Hi, this is Tom Larson with Tech Training for Teachers. In today's video, we are demonstrating the Desks feature of Chrome OS and show you how it can be used to streamline and organize your digital work environments. Let's get started. Virtual desks are basically individual work areas that take the headache out of trying to manage and sort through a host of applications or windows. With desks, a user can essentially create separate screens containing related content which can then be accessed via a specific keyboard shortcut command. To explain this further, let's say you are working on your Chromebook and you have two completely different jobs ahead of you. The first job requires you to use communication tools such as email and chat. The second job involves graphic creation. Here's how we create separate spaces. We'll leave our primary desk alone. This can be what we use for communication. In a new desk, let's create a space to work on graphics. On your keyboard, press the Show All Windows key. Using your mouse, go to the top of the screen. Click the plus symbol and title your new workspace. We'll call this desk Graphics. Click on the desk, launch Chrome, and go to Google Drawings. This is what we'll use to develop a graphic. Once it's loaded, you're ready to go. To return to your other desk, press and hold the search key and then the open bracket key. Press the search key and closed bracket key to go back. To manage your desks, press the show all windows key. To delete an existing desk, simply click the X icon on the desk thumbnail. To add more desks, click the plus symbol and repeat for as many desks as you need. Some sample desk names could be main, graphics, communication, data, or anything else that makes sense to you. Virtual desks are a great way to stay on top and better manage what you're working on or presenting to others. Teachers who rely on Chromebooks as their primary workstation for instruction should definitely check this feature out. That's it for today's video. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me via email. And if you enjoy videos like this, be sure to subscribe and tap the notification icon so you are alerted when new content is posted.